How we doing today guys? Sam back with this week's fishing report for you. Um, let's get right into it. Starting out with rockfish. Rockfish is your typical summer pattern. So really good fishing if you want to use some live spots, soft crab, things like that. Areas you want to go to is the structure when you're bait fishing. Areas like the lighthouses and the bridge pilings. 7 foot knoll, 6 foot knoll, areas like that. Um, definitely focus towards more of the upper bay right now. It seems to be still producing a little bit better. Um, however, I have heard some of the rivers here towards the mid bay have been picking up a little bit as far as the topwater fishing goes, especially in the mornings and evenings. So we are starting to see a few more fish down our way in the Severn, the Magathy, and um, all the way down to the South River. So fishing's picking up a little bit down our way. You don't have to run as far north. Of course, if you want to jig lures, it's a perfect time of the year to do that. Look for those schooled up fish, things like that, and you can really get into them. Um, moving on to the bluefish and mackerel. Typically, we've been seeing those coming all the way up to Thomas Point area-ish. Um, we've heard of a couple of them show up a little bit further, but typically, if you really want to have your best shot, you're going to want to get to Thomas Point South or Bloody Point in South. Areas like over towards Poplar, right off of there, finding those breaking schools of fish, casting into them with stink silvers, things like that's going to produce pretty well for the bluefish and mackerel. If you want to troll for them, of course you can do that too. You want to pick your speed up a little bit and troll some inline planers with some drone spoons, little tiny spoons like that to give you a good shot there. So push south and look for those breaking fish. If you want to cast lures or troll around the edges of those breaking birds, you can certainly do that. Really good fishing there. White perch fishing, um, from what I hear, is starting to pick up a little bit more than it was last month, which is a good thing to hear. It was a little slow. Fishing in the rivers and creeks, casting your small perch pounders and inline spinners, things like that. If you're fishing out there towards some hard bottom, you can always use some little Chesapeake's beakies, stuff like that, and jig those or tip that with bait, and that could be a good rig for you too. As far as crabbing goes, it's been doing pretty well. Um, it's always a little bit slower this time of the year when the heat gets picked up sometimes, but it's still really good to get out there. You can run your trout lines or your traps and still have pretty good success around all these rivers, the Magathy, the Severn. Crossing over to the Chester starting to pick up a little bit. Usually it does this time of the year. So pretty good crabbing there. Um, moving down a little bit further, we've heard of some of the bull drum coming all the way up to Chesapeake Beach area. So those guys looking to go out there and look for those brig bacon big breaking schools of red drum. You can certainly get into those if you want to head Chesapeake Beach and south. Keep going even further south, you start to get into the cobia. Similar tactics, kind of looking for those schools. Look for the rays casting in there, or you can set up and chum, of course, and some of your points down there with some LY, things like that. So your bigger stuff is still pretty far south right now. So that just about <clears throat> wraps it up. Thanks, guys, and have a good one.